It seems like only two years ago that we were standing outside the Pacific Coliseum to talk about U2 rehearsing in town. And here we are outside of BC Place where U2 has been rehearsing in town. What the band's rehearsing is the Joshua Tree Tour 2017, originally intended as a 30th anniversary tour with a few dates. Well, Bono and the Boys have decided to make it 33 dates. And it's starting the North American leg right here in Vancouver, where the band has started a number of tours. The Vertigo Tour, the Songs of Innocence Tour, and now this one. And they usually practice here too. In fact, the band has a great relationship with Vancouver. They've been seen around town, Seawall, various gas town restaurants. You may recall a few years ago that Bono got picked up with his aide when they got lost walking around West Vancouver and uh, a very famous hockey player gave them a ride home. That made national news. And this tour will probably make national news too. It's going to be a big deal because they're playing the Joshua Tree from start to finish. Now, why would they choose this album from 1987 over all the other albums they've presented? Probably because you 2 became superstars with this record. This is the album that gave us Where the Streets Have No Name, Still Haven't Found What I'm Looking For, many, many others. And there are some songs on this that have never been played before live, like Red Hill Mining Town, for instance. So the way the set breaks down, they're going to play the entire album from start to finish. People are going to get that checked off their bucket list because it's such a monumentally influential and important record. And then they're going to play some other songs from throughout their career, which is lengthy now. This is a chance for you to see U2. If you didn't see them on the first Joshua Tree tour, which was a long time ago, this is a chance to see them get caught up and catch a classic live right here inside BC Place. Hopefully nobody falls off the stage this time.